Hey, what's up guys? It's Kita. If you're new here, welcome back to my channel. So it is that time again to do a challenge. As you guys know, I do a challenge every month in my personal development planner, which is the wellness planner and my mini happy planner. And I've been a bit of a slacker, so it took a little bit of time for me to create this, but I do have it available. Of course, you guys know I'll always offer it free if you are subscribed to my blog. And so I'm gonna go ahead and decorate my monthly with a self-improvement challenge. You guys always ask me what challenge I'm doing next. So this is the challenge. And so hopefully you will all participate. So if you're new here to my channel i do hope that you will consider subscribing you have been enjoying it here and you will also give me a big thumbs up on this video if you do enjoy it so without further ado if you want to see how i'm going to decorate in my personal development planner and do this self-improvement challenge make sure to stay tuned All right guys, so here is the printable here. So all you have to do is just be a subscriber to my blog, uh, which is www.athomewithkita.com. I'll make sure to put a card above just so you can get to it easily. And then you go into the members only section. If you are a member, you'll just enter your credentials. And if you're not a member, it is free to be a member. You'll just sign up right there. And then you'll have access to this free printable as well as several others. So prior to this challenge, we did a happiness challenge. Then before that, we did a productivity challenge and a positivity challenge as well so these challenges have been super fun for me to just you know assess who I am and make myself better so I thought a self-improvement challenge would be the perfect one for February so let's go ahead and get started I'll show you my personal development planner if you haven't seen it yet again it's inside of my mini happy planner I have a tab above that says you go girl <laughs> and I'll show you January and so this is how the challenge looked for January. Super fun again, happiness challenge. And I did send this happiness challenge to 10 people for just being fabulous. And so I randomly chose and they got this uh, printed out for them because I do like to print and cut mine. So that's what I did for 10 people. And that made it easy for them to just put in their planner. So it is a PDF format, but you can load it into your Silhouette or Cricut, but there is some legwork that you'll have to do. If you don't wanna cut this by hand, you'll have to uh, figure that out on your own, um, drag it into that software and then figure out how to make the cut lines. And so, uh, but I made it super easy. This time around because I know this was a, a odd shape and it might have been a little bit tedious to cut but I think this one might be a little bit easier but either way hopefully you guys will still participate um, I know sometimes with cutting this stuff out it might be a little bit of a challenge but hey it's a challenge twofold right <laughs> and so let's go ahead and get started and we're gonna add February to my planner because as you can see we don't have February in here yet and then we're gonna go ahead and plan it out guys All right, so I've added February, so let's go ahead and turn to the monthly. And everything is fully formatted for the mini happy planner. I do also have a classic size happy planner version, just in case that is the one that you would prefer to add this to. And so I like doing it in my mini because I just like the size of it and it just works well for me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add each sticker to each day and then I'll talk you through some of the prompts. All right guys, so that was super easy, right? Adding all the prompts here. Lastly, we wanna add this, which is a sticker also. And we just wanna identify what the challenge is. And it is, again, the self-improvement challenge. So 30 things that you can do to improve yourself, which is 
what I'm about, positivity and self-improvement. So just to talk through a couple of things, again, there's 30 prompts. Um, the first one here says, share something you're proud of. Um, so you can share it on social media or you can write it in a journal or whatever you decide because number two does say start a journal, um, learn something new. I love number five, just take a long deep breath, y'all. Sometimes you gotta do that. Bake cookies for a friend, number seven. And number 29 is do nothing, y'all. I mean, I literally, do nothing <laughs> and i love those um eight is make a list of your accomplishments number 14 is declutter i am all about that marie i'm pretty sure i'm saying her name wrong but everybody's all into that uh, marie kondo stuff and so i'm thinking of watching the documentary on netflix if you watched it make sure to comment below let me know what you think of it but decluttering is a part of her whole thing so definitely declutter 16 read a good book 18, buy a coffee for a stranger. It doesn't even have to be coffee. It can be paying it forward. You know, if you're in line at a fast food restaurant, I try to do that from time to time. Just pay for the person's food behind you. So that's very kind. Um, 19, go for a walk. Write down your five-year dream plan. Text an old friend. I love 23 also to just turn off your phone, y'all. Sometimes we get so wrapped up into social media and just um, digital things. So it's important to kind of um, turn that off and just kind of deprogram yourself from that for you know however many days it takes for you and whatever you feel comfortable with um 24 is one of my faves be creative i love to be creative 26 write down five things that make you happy i love that as well plan your dream vacation you guys know we are going to portugal soon hopefully paris as well but we may be leaning towards a different place but that is my dream vacation so i am planning that so i can kind of check that off um 28 learn something new again 29 is the same as number seven do absolutely nothing and then 30 is to create a goal board so i love this self-improvement challenge and it's going to be super fun to do it for the next 30 days so comment below guys and let me know what you want to do next what type of challenge do you want to do i am planning on some sort of bible journaling challenge coming up but let me know what type of challenge you want to do. Maybe a fitness challenge. Um, drop me a comment below and let me know what you think. But that's it for this video, guys. I just wanted to go ahead and put this in my monthly spread. Remember that this is free available to you if you're a member of my blog. Super easy to do. Let me know if you have any questions. And sometimes um, some of you have been having some issues when you're first signing up for my blog. Um, make sure to refresh the page after you put in your credentials as far as what you want your username and password to be. And then refresh the page and you should be able to get in. Um, and so that that's the solution my husband has found um, helpful so hopefully that helps you guys but if you still have issues uh, or if you have any issues whatsoever make sure to send me an email or let me know um, so that I can help you guys get uh, logged in and become a member so thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you will participate in this challenge let me know if you do if you uh, print this out make sure to tag me on instagram i would love to see your spread a lot of times i like to add extra deco to the page but i'm keeping it simple this month and so i'm super excited to do this with all of you guys so thank you guys again so much for watching today hopefully you will consider subscribing to my channel if you're new here and if you're not new thank you so much for coming back again to join me for another video hopefully you like it you'll give me a thumbs up and you will also join me for another video next time in which case i'll see you then